Hey guys, this is the Macna contest video I told you about. Now, Macna takes place every single year somewhere in the United States. It's bounced out of the US once, went up to Canada, um, but I think the rest of them have all been in the United States. And I went to my first one back in 2002. This one next month, that's in two weeks, man, two weeks. Um, that one will be the 15th one I've gone to in a row. And I have been going to a bunch of these and I've had a great time every year. So you need to go and get yourself a lanyard and get in some buttons. <laughs> Let me tell you what Macna is about in case you don't know. <clears throat> First of all, it stands for the Marine Aquarium Conference of North America. And it's an educational event. It has grown into this massive entity uh, that fills a hotel with a whole bunch of hobbyists. Somewhere around 2,200 to 2,500 people attend these you know these days and when i went back in boy 2002 i think it was more like 800 and we thought that was good <laughs> so it's been growing but these are going to be the hardcore hobbyists and of course some new hobbyists that just found out about it and happens to be in their area if you can go you have the opportunity opportunity to learn lots of things in a matter of three days flat it's basically reef keeping college in a weekend and when you're buying books and you're buying magazines and you're reading forums online and you're talking with people in fish stores, you learn little bits. But imagine nonstop for three days in a row, surrounded by 145 vendors, having the opportunity to attend about 24 presentations that talk about lighting, food, uh, filtration, fish disease, uh, aquaculture, mariculture. Uh, these are just a few of the topics that are covered and that's how do you think i learned the things i learned it wasn't just by hanging out online and what i did with my very first macna i went to every single presentation there was probably 15 presentations that year and i went to all 15. then for the next six months every single time i saw a question online i said i've got the answer i uh would start typing hey i learned at macna that you should do this or i learned at macna that this will do that and it has just been kind of snowballing ever since I've learned tons uh, through the presentations of other speakers. Now this year I'll be doing a presentation and I'm talking about the construction of my fish room that I did back in 2010, 2011 and how it benefited my reef. So if you are going to come to Macna, then I would recommend you come early on Saturday morning because my talk is at nine in the morning. And the reason I picked 9 a.m. is because I have to work my booth Friday, Saturday and Sunday where I sell products for my shop. And so I wanted to get the talk on Saturday and then I wanted to go ahead and be in my booth to answer questions and to hopefully sell items. Now the contest is easy. For you to enter, all you have to do is subscribe to the channel. You have to like this video and you have to put a comment down below. Now you can comment why you've never gone before or you can comment why you wanna go this year. I'm not gonna hold you to a certain phrase to say you know, that you've gotta do a certain thing or say a certain thing. Just comment, participate, ask a question, uh, state a fact, <laughs> whatever it is you'd like to do, that'll get you entered in the contest. And what you'll win is for you and a buddy or a spouse or a child or you know, a parent, two tickets or two full conference passes to attend MACNA this year. It takes place in San Diego, California. It's from September 9th through 11th. And that is a, a three-day weekend, basically, of just getting a chance to learn all kinds of cool things and see the latest products. I love going to Macna to walk through all the booths. And what I do is I go there to see what's brand new. I know for a fact that there is the brand new Radeon Gen 4 that just came out, and that will be on display with lots of opportunity to ask questions and see it in person. And you know, there's so many other lighting vendors that will be there as well. There's probably 20, 30 vendors just selling lighting. There will be probably 30 or 40 vendors selling just corals. There will be skimmer companies and there will be food companies from frozen to dry goods uh you know dry foods there i mean there's just lots of opportunities and then for example one of my buddies has been working on this device to add alkalinity to your tank based on the results of what the water is measuring right now and he's getting that ready to bring with him to showcase at macna and it's things like that finding out the latest gear and how it works or what makes it tick or even talking to a vendor about something you've already purchased like for example, I love the smart ATO and you might own one, but if you could go to their booth and talk to them about how it's operating or how you feel it's not operating correctly, you might learn how you've got it set up incorrectly. So being there one-on-one -on -one, all day long, three days in a row, you have a lot to learn. 
and you can absorb it all. And you're gonna overhear people's conversations. You're gonna eavesdrop. It's just gonna happen because you're around so many people. And you know, of course, in the evenings we all hang out. Uh, there's the reception Friday night, which is usually a uh, finger foods type operation where you'll get all kinds of snacks to snack on and just kind of get a get together. Saturday night is the banquet, and the banquet is a catered affair, which your dinner is included, drinks, and uh, you have the opportunity to hear a keynote presentation. There will be some awards given out for best website and for Aquarius of the Year, and uh, uh, some scholarships are handed out for those that are studying to be marine biologists. So that's kind of fun. People dress up that night. Uh, Sunday's a huge raffle, but there's a raffle usually on Friday and Saturday as well. And that's where you can win all kinds of stuff. For example, uh, I've donated to this uh, Macna 450 gallon a day RODI systems. So there's a chance to win one of those if you're attending Macna this year. So you gotta go. Uh, matter of fact, I've been telling people to go forever. So um, a long time ago, I started calling myself the official Macna whore because I don't care what club is running it, I'm promoting it. And uh, I just love going and I think that everyone should go. And the nice thing is after you've gone once, you'll decide I need to go again. And when you don't go, you don't know what you're missing. And you might think, oh, it's just a glorified frag swap or something like that. But no, it's, it's huge, it's awesome. It's a lot of fun. Uh, the booths are so much nicer than they were uh, 14 years ago, 13 years ago. And uh, the companies are there to answer your questions. That's why they set up, that's why they come. And just being able to hang out afterwards at the bar or by the pool or wherever you're you know, finding other reef keepers, you can get into conversations and debates and arguments about you know, how you think GFO works while well, I'll stand there and tell you I think it's pointless. <laughs> and that's fine. I mean, there's lots of different ways to accomplish things in this hobby. So be sure that you enter this contest and then I hope that you win and you get to come and hang out. The nice thing is you get to do whatever you want. You know, of course, you're gonna have to cover your own transportation and your hotel, but you're getting in for free. And that is a gift from MeLovesReef.com. If you want to learn more about Macna, I'm going to put a couple of links in the description of this video below. I always want to say in the comments below, in the description below on YouTube. And uh, make sure that you're entering the contest on YouTube. If, you're, if you see this on Facebook or you see it on reef to reef or some other forum, commenting there won't enter you. You got to comment on YouTube, on my channel. Uh, now, let me just kind of go into why I love Macna because you think, well, you know a lot of stuff, Mark, aren't you set for life? There's always something new to learn. And for me, I, one of the things that I really love is that every year when I go, I get to meet up with friends that I've made over the last decade or longer. And when I was you know, reading Coral Magazine, uh, this is the November issue about the Yellow Tangs, I uh, was flipping through it and I was really kind of, I don't know, stunned that I know so many of these authors now one-on-one. -on -one. And that's kind of cool, right? Because, you know, when, if you get a magazine from whatever, Time Magazine, and you're just reading articles by people, you usually just read the article and you're done. But I actually know the people behind these stories, and I get to know their tanks, I get to know their, their passions, and I get to catch up with them at Macna. Uh, we hang out at the bar, we drink, we laugh, we tell stories, and uh, it's, it's awesome. So when you go to Macna, make sure you're trying to make friends. You know, meet up with someone, get their contact information, make friends with them on Facebook, and that way they, um, you know, you can stay in contact and you can update each other on how your tanks are doing. Uh, if you're into the whole uh, fan thing, fanboy thing, you could run up to Bob Fenner and say, "Can you autograph my book?" I mean, these are different things that you can do. I mean, there's nothing wrong with that. I mean, that's awesome, right? I've got some of my stuff autographed. So that's something to look forward to. The uh, San Diego Club has been planning this for years. When I planned the one for 2012, we spent three, four years in the planning stages until we got to the end to fruition of the event. And it's a lot of effort to put these things together. So I know the work they've gone through to make this happen. And I was excited you know, and said, you know, hey, I wanna give away a couple of tickets. So thank you to the San Diego Club for uh, donating those to this contest. So uh, I really hope that the winners enjoy this because it's a great opportunity and it's gonna save you money at the same time. If you wanna see the previous Macna from last year that I put on YouTube, here's a link right above me and you can go 
I hope I pointed the right way. Maybe it's that way. <laughs> I think it's this way. <laughs> it's probably that way now I think about it. Anyway, I'm going to go like this. It's going to be around me somewhere. And that was a video that I put up on YouTube a year ago. So if you were like, hey, I want to know more. I want to see what one of these things is. Part of it I filmed. This year I'm going to film some of it as well. Uh, but I am working my booth. So I'll have to break away and grab a few minutes here and there to maybe find some cool things to share with you guys. Uh, so that's it. Thanks so much for watching. And uh, I'll see you again in a week.